how are you? I'm all right. Are you all right? I'm okay, mate. I mean, you're yeah. plugging things in. No, I know, I know, the tip, I know. Like, I'm plugging my brain in. in a china shop. I'm plugging my brain in. Pl- everything. You've yeah. got how many computers you've got, got there? Got my toothbrush. Electric toothbrush just been. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> hold on. My iPad's just been plugged in. Hold on. It's like you me just drill. come in in the biggest <laughs> rush drill. ever. I mean, what hold is... on. Hold on. Look at the state my of your table. Mate, it's clean. It's clean, there's nothing wrong with that. Though. I'm ready, I'm like a coiled spring. <laughs> ready to spring into action. <laughs> How are you? you all right? I'm all right, mate. I'm all right. Good. What have you been up good. to today? What have I been up to today? I woke up late. I didn't go to the gym today. Woke up late. 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 And um, it's a big day. My boy does ballet and then he does tennis. Ballet and tennis? He does ballet. It's ballet. An intense day. It is. It is. So I took him ballet, took him tennis, and then flew into here. That's yeah. what I've done, mate. No, a bit of a dull day, actually, but... Nothing much, then. No, no nothing not much. much. No, nothing t- much. Tomorrow's a bigger day for him, mate. I'm eating some friends for lunch. Oh, yeah? Mm. A little Friday lunch? Yeah. Lovely. Yeah? A yeah. yeah. few, yeah. few, few, few Yeah, Pino definitely. Grigios. Move on. <laughs> <laughs> right, plug your appliances in. Yeah, I'm done. And let's talk I'm, football. My brain, my brain... What are you getting up to today? You been, been punching any bags or no, anything like no, that? No, no training today. No training. The no, shoulder's, no shoulder's a bit stiff. Oh, Shoulder. Yeah, it's a bit oh, stiff. A bit of work. What have you been doing in the shoulder? Which, <laughs> just the one shoulder, is it? Yeah, you just the one filthy. stem. St- you is the- <laughs> Jeez. Yeah. You know, I've, I've got bad back as well. Got a bad back. How old are you? Yeah, but that's not. That's, uh, I'm 35. But that's not from boxing. Is that from carrying me? It's from carrying you. <laughs> <laughs> boom, boom. Right, let's get into it. A huge yeah. night. Premier League action. Arsenal. I mean, what a performance in Brilliant. the end from them. To go away from home to beat Wolves, who have been in really good form recently. Um, I actually felt from with the Martinelli incident. Now it's it's a big talking point. Me and you argued over it yeah. for about ten minutes, yeah. and almost it, it takes the gloss off it a little bit because Arsenal ended up getting the three points, which they deserved yeah. because they defended <laughs> brilliantly. But the, the the red card, Jason, yeah. is is absolutely shambolic for me. In my in my opinion, that is shambolic. Martinelli is a young lad, and if you if you haven't seen it. He's basically, he's gone out for a throw. He's lost the ball, goes out for a throw-in. Um, and he, he puts his arm on the lad who's taking the throw-in. He still gets the throw-in away. The, um, the Wolves player goes down the wing with it. He chases after him, Martinelli, and makes a foul. That's a booking. But the ref comes over and books him twice. Two yellows in the same phase and sends him off. Mm-hmm. How can you book a player who doesn't know he's on a yellow card and give him two yellows and send him off. A shocking well, decision. Well, well, first off, brilliant Arsenal win. And, you know, that is a massive result. I would say, and Arsenal fans can tell me I'm wrong, I'd say that's probably their biggest victory this season because you're going away to a side that can, can concede very few goals. They're incredibly stingy. Um, 17 goals is all they've conceded. They don't score many. They've only scored 19. That is a big problem. For Bruno Large, once they went one 0 down, it's a question of can you get you back and can you get yourselves back? And look at the goals they they score 19, 19, 22 games. That's, yeah. that's appalling. Seventeen against is a brilliant record. But credit to Arsenal going down to ten men, well deserved victory. But I am sorry, and this is not going to be nice to hear for Arsenal fans. But Martinelli deserved it. They are two yellows, right? It's not the referee's job. To make sure that he knows he's on a yellow. First off, what well, is? He tried to stop a throw in with his hands. That's a yellow card. It's a yellow card. Yeah. You try and stop. It's, you, it's, it's a soft it, yellow. It's a really soft yellow. That. I don't care if it's soft or it's hard. It's a soft yellow. It's, it's a yellow. And the he problem, doesn't know he's on the second yellow. Well, use your brains. Don't give away. The second one was a blatant foul. He's stopping an attack. So he's tried to stop the throw in, which set up the attack that he then had to make a foul. I think this is brave refereeing, and I'm being. Do you know what? How is it brave? Tell me. I tell you what's brave. brave because because he's got to make a call about two. It's the easy decision to book him once. It's the easy decision. No, it's the, the, the right deci- decision. It's the no. Today he got it right. Michael Oliver's our best referee. You do not do that. You do not stop it. You can't expect to. Okay, had he not made that second foul, if he'd been booked for the first one, no one's going to say a word, right? No, but then he knows he's on the yellow. Tough. So if he makes another mistake and he makes a tough, foul, tough. and he gets sent off, that's on Martinelli. Tough. Tough. You, you, if, you, if you're going to... But come just... on. The referee can quite easily go up to him and say, that's a foul, I'm booking you for that. That one you got away with. He, he tried to stop Wolves' attack twice. Blatant by, by, by one with his hands, one with his body. Both the bookable offences. 
It's not that both are bookable offences. You can't book someone who Why doesn't not? know he's on a yellow. Yes, you can. You can't. You can, well, you can, because it just happened. But I just think it's a really good Talk sport show. breaking that, news. And Michael Oliver is the best referee and... Average referee. It's, it's, you know, look, They're all average. It, it, Arsenal, Arsenal got the three points tonight. But look, it's another red card. Und, under, under Arteta, this is a problem for Arsenal. It's a problem for Arteta. It's another player they're going to miss. Martinelli, I thought, had a fine game. I think it's a real... You say he's brave. Yeah, but brave you say decision. The referee, why is it brave? I feel like Arsenal... Because it's the easy and look, call. I, it's crazy that I'm actually saying this, but I'm defending Arsenal here. <laughs> I think they're getting hard done by with some of the decisions. I think it's like an easy option to send an Arsenal player off every week. Oh, they're real disciplined. Oh, you know, that's what they've got them types of players in their side. We'll easy send him... I'm going to make an example. You know, he's made an example tonight of, of Martinelli when he didn't need to. Yes, he did. He's he, a young lad. I'm sorry. You know, he's playing sorry, but in the moment. He knew what he was doing on both occasions. These were pre... He, these were, the, he knew exactly what... Doesn't what, know he's on the yellow. Don't try and stop a throw in with your hands. Doesn't that's know a, he's on the yellow. That's a bookable offence. Shoving in the back, stopping an attack, bookable offence. Both are bookable offences, both the yellow cards, two lemons equal a strawberry. Off you go.